channel my name is Raina Cherian and in today's video I kind of wanted to do a what I eat in a week and I know I have done this before and I love this video so much and so I wanted to film one more again and I also know that you guys really love this video as well so that's why I wanted to film it once more uh, and this time I kind of have like a lot of new recipes that I've tried out this week and so I kind of just wanted to like share them with you guys and also um, yeah I hope you guys enjoy all right you guys so today is Monday and uh, we are are, it's about like 9 a.m. in the morning right now so I'm gonna make myself some breakfast so if you've seen my last video you'll know that I've made some like blueberry bagels and I had exactly one left over so I'm basically just gonna like heat this up and also drizzle it with some honey for breakfast today and um, yeah would I actually want to like try different types of bagels actually so this time I've made like blueberry but I want to try like couple of different flavors maybe in like some cherry jalapeno one or even like a strawberry one so uh but yeah for today we have like my blueberry bagel and i'm just gonna like drizzle with honey and have that for breakfast <laughs> you guys so it is uh, lunch time now and I am actually like pretty hungry so I saw this recipe online and it's like a little Turkish dish so it's basically like this uh, bread where you have like you know spiced meat just like kept on it and you like bake it so um, I'm gonna try that on my own so I don't really have like pizza dough so usually it's like made on pizza dough but I have like some tacos so I think I'm gonna like just like press the meat on the tacos and just like bake it in the oven and just like top it with some salad so uh, that's what I'm gonna do <laughs> you guys so i'm basically done oh my god these look so 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 good i'm so excited to try these i've never actually made these before this is my first time uh but like my salad just has like a little bit of like cherry tomatoes um lettuce some onion and also some jalapeno so yeah i'm gonna try these now So it is around evening time right now. So it's about like 7.30. I just got done with a workout, but I'm going for a movie today. So I'm gonna have a little bit of like some some movie theater like snacks today for like dinner. Um, I most probably order like a pizza or something. So um, yeah, let's go. Hey everyone, 
happy Wednesday. We're almost at the end of this work week, but um, today it's almost um, 9 a.m. in the morning right now, and so I kind of wanted to like make some breakfast. Today we're making some protein-based uh, pancakes, and I'm really excited to try this. Uh, I, it's like a new brand that I've not tried before, so um, yeah, let's go make some pancakes. All right, you guys, so the um, one that I'm using today is uh, this one. This one is by Kodiak, and it's basically a protein packed like pancake and you can either make like pancakes or like waffles with these and um, this is in the dark chocolate like flavor so i'm gonna make like pancakes using this one Um, one of them had a little bit of like a conjoined twin situation I just didn't expect it to like really join that much but um, anyways I've made my pancakes and unfortunately my strawberries like my fresh strawberries kind of like got mold so we can't really use that but I'm gonna top this off with a little bit of honey and then enjoy them So I have actually made my lunch right now. So these are basically rice paper egg rolls. So um, it's just basically like eggs, mushrooms, carrot, cabbage, um, and spring onions. So I basically just like sauteed all of them, added a little bit of soy sauce and chili oil, and just like kind of like made these uh, spring rolls. And I just like wrapped them up in like rice paper. And I also have like a little bit of like a dipping sauce. So this is with um, soy sauce and uh, chili oil as well. So 
I just like recently started getting into um, a little bit of like rice paper rolls. So I've tried them out before and I really love them and which is why I kind of wanted to make them again this week. And I just feel like it's such a great like filling um, yet like somewhat healthier like meal since it has like a lot of like veggies so i think you can like basically incorporate like whatever veggies you want so you can even make them like non-veg with like a little bit of like chicken or like even like i don't know pork like basically anything that you want and so um yeah i'm gonna like enjoy these So it is lunchtime and it is Thursday today. So um, today for uh, lunch, I kind of made uh, this one. So this is basically like khichdi. It's like an Indian dish, but I also kind of like made it a little bit different. So it has like a little bit of like cherry tomatoes and like lemon in it. So it's like a lemony tomato khichdi. And I also topped it off with a little bit of like Asian flavorings as well. So it's like a little bit of like spring onions mixed with like chili oil. So that's what this is. And I love this one so much. So this is actually a recipe from Mob. And uh, when I saw it, I was like, oh my God, this looks so good. So I'm not usually a kitchen person, but uh, when I saw this, I really wanted to make this. So yeah. I mean I love like the lemony flavor that comes through this and even like those cherry tomatoes just like pops up like a little bit of juicy tomato in it so it tastes like really really good. you guys so it is dinner time um and uh this is gonna be like the last meal of this week and i'm so so happy uh to share with you what i made today so 
this is basically like my dinner this is actually like pasta i know i'm gonna show you in detail for a minute and so this is basically like pasta it's like ricotta basically and i love i actually handmade this pasta and it's in the shape of roses and it also it's basically like a ravioli and it's based it basically has like a ricotta and spinach filling and also this like sauce is like a pea and tarragon sauce and i basically got this idea from um instagram i saw someone like make something very similar and so i kind of wanted to make this for myself and i'm honestly so proud i handmade pasta and i handmade ravioli and i'm just like chef's kiss so let me show you guys in detail this is basically like my pasta i mean the roses came out so 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 well and i'm honestly so proud of the way that i made all of this one and even the color just everything together i love it so much i know that the pour on this plate is not aesthetic but i mean it tastes so good you guys so that's it for today's video i hope you guys really enjoyed it my favorite thing all week was the rose pasta that i had made oh my god it was so so good and i just absolutely loved it so much and i want to like really try and start like making a lot more pasta at home but apart from that i hope you guys really enjoyed and found at least like some new recipes that you could like try and create like your own and um yeah thank you guys so much for watching if you guys enjoyed this video make sure to give it a thumbs up like comment share and subscribe and i'll see you guys in my next one bye everyone